shoes, more tennis shoes than anyone else in the history of HSN. And you'll see the latest version at midnight. All right, so let's, this next item. So Mark Gill's gonna be joining me in one second. Hi, Mark. And here's what I said to him. I said, Mark, baloney. I said, I have never, ever seen anything that can go in a microwave and actually make it anything crisp. Because we know what happens in the microwave. It's gray and it's mushy and it's bad. Well, Mark said, you know what, Suze, finally, you've met the one item that really will do that. It will make food genuinely crisp and you have the convenience of using a microwave. Is that not true, Mark? That is true, is exactly that true right. what I said to you too? It is exactly I went, true. I went, nope, I've never <laughs> seen it. They never Never work and you said what? if it don't work I don't want it that's right that's and, you, it. and literally that was his philosophy yep. you've seen things like I've this I've seen before. things like this before I passed on them guys it's got to work properly and I'll tell you something America is in love with their reheats and here's why look at that when I promise you crisp food in the microwave I'm not kidding by the way not just crisp even the best of us burn it sometimes <laughs> in the microwave. Oh, now that's crisp. Isn't that hysterical? So let me put this over here just for a second. I want you to hear this, okay? Guys, this is out of the microwave. Ready? No oh, wow. kidding. And that is melty, ooey, gooey, oh, man. perfect. So I'll tell you what, if you're a mom or a dad who wants to, the, the kids to start to learn how to cook, this is a great way to do it because they're not going to burn the house down, but they can kind of take care of their own lunch. So here's sure. where I'm going to show you how to work this, okay? Okay. It's very, very simple to use. Now, here's what makes it work the way it does. Like the best cookware in the world, it has aluminum sandwiched in between two pieces, hear that sizzle, mm. of non-stick top and bottom. Now the aluminum in the middle is what grabs hold of that heat from the microwave. So I always like to say this gives you the power of an air fryer, the speed of a microwave, and the results of an oven. And that's what we're all looking for. So all you're gonna do is you're gonna preheat it for about two minutes, okay. and that really is it. I'm gonna check it after about three and give it a flip, and that really, really? is it. Perfect, huh. crispy, grilled cheese sandwich, about three minutes. Don't you love it? Real crispiness out of your microwave, not the gray, mushy stuff that we're using. To. Exactly. Oh, yeah, me too. Aren't you bummed when you first bought the microwave? You thought, this is the answer. It's going to cook everything in the world. And what do you do? You make popcorn and you heat up coffee. And heat up water. That's, that's all it. you're doing that's with it. That's literally all right? you do. And think of the uh, space that it's taking up in your kitchen, man. That's True. some valuable real estate you're giving up over there. But this is what it's all about right here. This is the heart and soul of the Rahitza and is taking it? care of your <gasps> pizza. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> all right. The whole boardroom of people came up with that. So, guys, let's Listen to me close, okay? This is the number one most reheated food in America, period. And we're all doing it wrong. We put it on a microwave and it's all floppy. The oven takes 15 or 20 minutes. Look at that. Guys, that is beautiful. Listen. Oh, man. Or actually, you, I, I need you I here. Grab that fork and go ahead and feel that. Oh. No kidding. Right. <laughs> She's like, wait, what? And <laughs> Listen. I had to take it. Yeah, that's really that's crispy. That's the Rahitza magic Ooh, right this, there. I, that even looks better than the original. Doesn't it? Of course, yeah, that because looks delicious we've given about. it a little more color. A little crispy on the pepperoni. <laughs> I love, love crisp pepperoni. Oh. Love it, love it. And have a look here, guys. Non-stick. It's the easiest thing to clean you'll ever work with. You know what happens. You use that stuff for the oven. The cheese melts everywhere. The smoke goes everywhere. Right. This is so simple, so easy. And all you do is just take your pizza. Pop it on, and that's it. That's You're going to take it to the microwave with the lid on. Now, by the way... But you preheat it every time. You preheat about two minutes. Okay. Now, that lid, but it's already hot because we already had the pizza. Oh, you can just keep the party going. Oh, there you go. And the lid, by the way, we thought of everything. We don't want to keep too much moisture in there because that has a tendency to sog things out. Right. So we're going to let a little bit of that steam oh, escape. Guys, perfect. I love working with this. The kids love working with this. Any food you can think of, put that crisp back on it. Well, I, love I it. thought the one thing that got me is you've got little ones and they love their chicken nuggets. Right. And you're in a real hurry and you're like, okay, I just need to knock this out. How long? <laughs> no, seriously, how long yeah. does it take to heat up the oven, stick them in there, get them hot, and feed the children? Exactly. Now think about it. You're taking the speed of the microwave and now getting the results of an oven. Exactly. Like that's kind of one of those things you got to go, really? My microwave is just <laughs> not for heating up water and making popcorn anymore. Think Perfect. about that. I love what Mark said. You're going to get the speed of a microwave right. results of an oven. And that's what we're looking for, guys. Have a look here. Remember what I said? Like the best cookware in the world, it has aluminum at the core. That's what grabs that microwave heat and transfers it to the nonstick surface. So anything that hits that surface is going to put that crisp on it. And when we come back, this is why I love it. This is why everybody I talk to loves it. This because, why guys, love it. <laughs> there is a certain class of leftover that just oh. doesn't reheat 
very well. That's so true. So whether you're cooking your favorite convenience or fried foods from the freezer or, or the grocer's okay. freezer, or if you're doing it in reheating, guys, you're going to get those perfect results every time. So French fries that you love, and by the way, this is what I love right here. Out of the box or on a leftover. Watch this, you guys. So this can be frozen from the freezer. Exactly. Oh, wait, here, let me just see one. Exa you got to try yeah, it. I'm doubting Thomas. This is no kidding time, you guys. <gasps> oh, my gosh. And the outside's <laughs> and not it's mushy. And listen, listen, listen. You guys listen. look like... <laughs> Ready? I love it. Here we go, go, go. It's not mushy. <laughs> Isn't that the best? Listen, make this long enough, you can start skipping rope and lose some of the calories <laughs> you may need in the market. Let's put it right here. Now, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to throw those guys right there. Now, here's one of the ones that I love. How many times do we head out to the club or, you know, the big game or something, and we're going to order chicken wings? Think about it, you guys. $13, $14.95 a pound oh, true. Yep. for chicken wings. That's too much money. <laughs> you can do this at home for a fraction of the price. Oh, my goodness. That's why we have cloths. <laughs> for a fraction of the price, guys. And that's what I love about it. Check this out. You don't have to spend that much time and money. Go ahead and use your reheat to pop it in there for minutes, and you've still got that crisp. You've you can that hear crunch. it. Yeah, you exactly. actually can hear it, This too. is where you really hear it. You ready? Yeah. Look oh, at that's that, you great. guys. Steamy, perfect, billowy, and perfect. Whether it's from the freezer or yeah. whether it's leftovers. And by the way, leftovers is what I love about this. To be able to put that crisp back right. on. Well, the it. thing is, how much do you spend for a meal at a restaurant? Right. And then you're like, oh, I've got leftovers. I'm taking it home. And guess what? No one ever eats the leftovers. Because <laughs> right. they're just not good a day later. Well, now bring them back to life. I mean, they will actually probably taste better because now they're crisp again. So here's right. what I want you to remember, too. This, we've already sold 2,100. Right. I have a little bit over 1,000 remaining. And then this will be what we call sold out. It's going to be gone. Um, this was saved for our hour tonight, so it was not on earlier. It was on yesterday. And basically, more than half of what we have is gone. Finally, use that microwave for something else than making popcorn. Right. And try it. And here's what I love. When I was talking to Mark, and Mark, I've known you now for like 14 long years. Time. Long time. Mark, you've seen him on infomercials. He's got a great reputation. And you got a lot going on the website yes, and all this crazy stuff. He said to me, Suze, I never go on the air on a product or with a product that I don't truly believe. And he's seen many of these versions. And quite frankly, I know for a fact he passed him up. Then he was introduced to this. And you said, finally, it was one that you were going to actually show off. Oh, show that one look, side. Look, 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 look. Look at that. <gasps> Guys, oh, that's you saw really me done. put that in. That's really, really done. <laughs> Don't you love it? Oh, my gosh, so I'm gonna that's brilliant. So I'm going to put it in for the last 30 seconds, and, and you it's know finished. what? It's not super dry. Well, exactly. Like, that's the other problem. You stick something in a microwave, and it just sucks all the moisture right. out of it, and it's like it's like eating dust, really. <laughs> that's what it is, like eating dust. That is so, still moist enough. The bread has the right texture without exactly. getting super dry and hard. Exactly oh, right. Oh, you're just going to cook some eggs? Well, you know what? You can... Do some fun stuff oh. from scratch in here. Remember what I told you? Sure. That aluminum core is going to heat that non-stick surface. That's going to get that food going for you. That's so great. whether it's eggs, whether it's a little bit of shrimp actually started stamping, cooking them already, which is kind of interesting. It, that's what I mean. Yeah. You can see how that preheat got things going. So we're going to give it a little bit of that, a little bit of pepper, not much for salt on my eggs. And guys, in three minutes, this is going to be done. No pans to worry about, nothing to scrape. Great non-stick coating, so it's easy to use. And I've got another one out here. So let's go ahead. Oh, you know what? And th about three minutes. I think we unplugged that one. Oh, okay. So let's go over here, and we'll pop that guy in. Yeah, for about three minutes. What's okay. great about this is nothing to clean at the end. It's a quick wipe. Oh, right, right, right. And here we go. How about a little bit? So again, bit? this is now from raw. We're not, exactly. it's not reheated. We're not pre-cooked. Exactly, guys. So simple things like shrimp and great eggs, idea. things that cook really quick. Yeah are really fun in the rajitza. So now not only are you doing leftovers, not only are you doing uh, you know simple sandwiches, now you're doing actual meals in your microwave. And you know what? That actually holds a lot. That's a surprising. That's a serving for about four. Yeah, I would say of the shrimp, that probably is about two, three or four people could eat just that in that one. And again, exactly. how often are we just in such a hurry nowadays because our lives are so packed that we want to eat, we want to have something good, we want to have something hot, and we don't want to go through a drive through Exactly. Or maybe you've thrown out the leftover pizza because it's just kind of, or the leftover Chinese Chinese food because the next day it was kind of waxy. Bring it back. <laughs> no, seriously, how often right. does that happen? You're like, it doesn't taste so good day two. Bring it back to life. Bring that crispness back. Make those quick meals that taste like they've been in the oven for 45 minutes. Well, and have a look here, guys. Yeah, I've said it great. before. I'll say it again. 
and That's all great. of your convenience foods, all of your fried favorites. And I'll tell you to put that crisp back on your leftovers. When's the last time you tried to reheat a French fry, anything crispy, you, panko, fish, you wouldn't do it. it's soggy, you don't <laughs> want it. Guys, let me show you why this works the way it does again, okay? You have that nice, thick piece of aluminum right in the middle. The best cookware in the world has aluminum in the middle, that tri-ply. We all know tri-ply. Imagine now in an appliance designed to do what you're seeing on air today, and that's what this is for you guys. This is designed to get introduced into your everyday life in the kitchen. That's why we've given you that non-stick surface so the cleanup is so easy. And the to use it, guys, is simple. You go, simply preheat it for two to three minutes. Mm -hmm. Any standard microwave, I like to use around 1,000, 1,100 watts for your best results. Okay. All the instructions are in the cookbook. You've got a nice silicone layer here to trap that moisture and steam in, but we let out just enough through the steam hole so everything stays crispy. That's smart. Don't you and love it? I, I, you guys have, might have seen this on infomercial, and right now it's like one of the most popular ones that are playing. And so if you've seen it and you've always been going, goosh, I kind of want to try it, I think we're the best way to do it, especially with FlexPay <laughs> and free shipping. What is this? Is this our This, this is our the grilled, grilled cheese, cheese that we made from scratch. Now, <laughs> this is, you know, I tell you, there's, there's no pan. I, I, I peaked. I peaked. Oh, look geez, oh, Pete. Oh, look, look this look. cheese is bubbling. Look at it bubble. Crispy, oh, it bubbly, good perfect. Too. My hand's on fire. <laughs> look at this, guys. <laughs> Non-stick, too. How perfect is that? Crispy on that side, crispy wow. on that side That's in just great. minutes. Let me go ahead That's here. That's very surprising, honestly. Right? It yeah, really well, is. As soon as I walked in to, to have a, a host <laughs> with... meeting, what, yeah. what did I call you? Suze? Suze's? <laughs> yeah, Suze's? Yeah. Suze's. <laughs> Suze's? And he said, I looked at him and I saw what it was and I go, no, nope, I'm calling Ooh. your bluff. This that is baloney. It's not going to work. <laughs> <laughs> so this is the first time I've actually seen it, like along with you. I, and I've never seen any of these systems actually work like this. Look at so that, this, you guys. Oh, I can, I can see why you decided Here's to Here's what I love on. about this. That's great. I've worked with products like this in the past. It's so hot, the cheese almost disappears. Mm -hmm. Look at this, you guys. It's perfect awesome. every single time. Now, I've been checking on the timing behind me. It's always a little trick, especially when I have cheese stuck in my mustache. <laughs> I'll save that for a little later. I was going to mention that, but we're going to show shrimp. That's it. We're going to show the shrimp. Actually, I think we have the, the, oh, the eggs. eggs. Oh, the eggs are in there. That's I right. I love it. All right, this is the last one. You ready? The last one we got Don't just a second. Da, 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 da. Fresh oh eggs. Gosh. Look at this, you guys. Look at every time. I love it. And nothing to clean and perfect yolks every time. Oh, there we go. <laughs> <laughs> Did I get it? Yes, Am I making a mess? You have to say that. You have to say that. You're going to hold that time. for me? Sure, of course. There we go. And I'll try and do that without stabbing there you because I like you a lot. Look. And guys, look at that. How perfect is that? Very Three minutes. Clever. And here's your cleanup. All right, so here we go, less than half available. Why does that matter? Because it's almost sold out. <laughs> like if you're on the fence, you're like, oh gosh, I really do want to use my microwave more than heating up Love water it. or making popcorn. <laughs> really, think about it. It gives you oven Ooh. results, but you do it in the microwave with the speed that we love. That's why we love that. microwaves, they're fast. I'm gonna the take the second degree burns. are awful, now they're good. Oh, you gotta eat that one. <laughs> the crew